On July 6, 1919, German physician Magnus Hirschfeld established the Institute for Sexual Sciences. Hirschfeld, who was queer, had been an advocate for those who transgress gender and sexual norms for decades, and he based much of his activism off of anti-colonial struggles. And so Hirschfeld resolved to create a library by, for, and about people who did not abide by fixed and binary norms of gender and sexuality. The Institute served as a professional and personal space, and Hirschfeld lived there with his longtime partner, Carl. The Institute's existence was enabled in part by the relatively tolerant atmosphere of Weimar Germany, and the Nazis eventually burned the Institute to the ground, along with the singular, self-authored archive of queer existence. Hirschfeld, who was also Jewish, was exiled from Germany and eventually settled in France, where he died in 1935. In spite of the regime's efforts to destroy the Institute, it remains an iconic example of queer community and power building. I'm Eric Cervini, and that was The Sip of History.